Today we're testing the SwitchBot floor lamp. We are gonna see what's in the box, the setup, home assistant integration, and then I'll show you what this lamp can do, how to add it to the SwitchBot app, and then we'll do an automation example into home assistant. Welcome back to Smart Life. I am Alex and in this video we'll cover the matter enabled SwitchBot floor lamp. It has 16 million colors, scenes and smart control to matter and the most important part it works in Home Assistant. For the unboxing and physical setup, Ryan handled almost everything himself. All the parts are easy to figure out what goes where, the instructions are simple and the assembly is very straightforward. He put the whole lamp together, I only helped at the end by tightening the screws. You start by attaching the plastic piece to the base, then add the each section one by one, securing them with two screws at each joint. After that you insert the flexible LED strip into the channel, pull it down, close the top cap and finish at the base with the plastic cover that keeps the cable in place. Finally just plug in the power adapter. From box to fully assembled this takes just a few minutes, even if you've never built a lamp before. It also comes with a physical remote, which is perfect if you don't want to use your phone every time. You can control it locally, no app needed. The response is instant, colors change immediately, brightness adjusts smoothly. Ryan figured it out right away, which tells me the controls are simple and intuitive. I should also mention that the box includes two mounting brackets, so you can mount the lamp on the wall in a horizontal position. Let's start with the SwitchBot app, because this is the first step. The setup process is very easy. You need to create an account if needed, then open the app, but make sure the Bluetooth is enabled on your phone. Then tap Add Device. Hold the power button of the lamp for 2 seconds and the lamp is going into pairing mode, then press Connect. Follow the steps and then insert your Wi-Fi credentials. Now give the lamp a name so it's easy to identify it. And that is it, it is ready to use. I have a firmware update available, make sure you update if it's available on your setup as well. Inside the app you get loads of features, full control, on and off, brightness adjustments, color selection and the built-in scenes are great. Because the lamp supports matter we can bring it directly to home assistant without hacks or any workaround. In the SwitchBot app we will need the matter pairing code. We go to settings, then matter setup, then click next and then copy the matter pairing code. In the home assistant companion app find your matter integration and add matter device. Select no if it's new, then choose setup with the QR code. Now paste in the matter pairing code we copied earlier. It takes a few seconds to connect and then we need to wait and that is it. The device is connected and you have your switchbot floor lamp into home assistant. Now let's build a quick and really cool automation in Home Assistant. We need to go to Settings, Automations and Scenes and tap Create Automation. In my case, I already made one so I'll show you just how it works. I'll scroll down and open my automation. Here it is. First we need to add a trigger. Mine is the TV. When the TV turns on, Home Assistant does a few actions. First one, the Sonos lamp next to the TV turns off. Then the delay of 300 milliseconds and then the SwitchBot floor lamp turns on. And finally, I set the color and brightness exactly how I wanted for my movie mode, a dim purple ambience. So all right, let's test this. Overall, the SwitchBot floor lamp is a great option for smart RGB lighting with Home Assistant support, clean design, local control and really fun effects. Thank you for watching, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.